Hello everyone, I'm Svetlana and I'm glad to see you all on my so, We are going to read the book about the, about Curious Church. Curious Church and the fire fighters. So let's read to know what what has happened. Yeah, with George in this book. Mm -hmm. Interested? So, let's read to know. Fire station. <clears throat> This is George. He was a good little monkey and always very curious. Today, George and his friend, the man with the yellow hat, joined Miss Gray and her class on their field trip to the fire station. The farm chief was waiting for them right next to a big red fire engine. Welcome, he said, and he led everyone upstairs to begin their tour. There was a kitchen with a big table. And there were snacks for everyone. The fire chief told them all about being a firefighter. George tried hard to pay attention, but there were so many things for a little monkey to explore, like that shiny brass pole in the corner. Where did the pole go? George was. Curious. Why it went back downstairs? There was a great big fire engine. There was a map of the city and there was a whole wall full of coats and hats and the black boots. George had an idea. First, he stepped in the pair of boots. Next, he picked out a hamlet. And finally, George put on a jacket. He was a firefighter. Suddenly, bring The firefighters all rushed in. This is not my helmet, said one. My boots are too big, said another. Hurry, hurry, called the fire chef. A bright red light on the map of the city told him just where the fire was. There was no time to waste. One by one, the firefighters jumped into the fire engine. And so did George. <clears throat> the fire engine with all the firefighters sped out of the fire station. And so did George. The siren screamed and the lights flashed. The engine turned right, then it turned left. Ooh, ooh, ooh. When the horn and George held on tight.
And just like that, the fire engine and all the firefighters pulled up to a pizza parallel on Main Street. Smoke was coming out of a window in the back and crowd was gathering in the street. Thank goodness you are here, cried the cook. The firefighters rushed over the truck and started unwinding their horses. They knew just what to do and George was ready to help. He climbed up on the horse reel. Okay, we stop for now. And the continuation of the story will be next time. So, if you like the story about Curious Judge, put a like. And subscribe if you want to know the continuation of the story about the firefighters. So, see you soon with new readers. Bye-bye for now.